United Methodist Church uh, began work this summer during the month of May and June on some major repair projects both at the church and at the parsonage and these photographs illustrate some of the problems that we encountered when we removed a deck that needed to be replaced. Here we have the superstructure of the building uh, that has been rotted. The gentlemen were replacing the deck uh, uh, which needed repairs and were digging out the uh, dirt that was located in front of it when those rotted boards were discovered. Uh, they backfilled the area with uh, gravel products so that there would be no problems with clay and when they pulled away the boards they literally could put their hands through the uh, wood that was there. At the same time the men were working on that project a few of the other members had hit the uh, two storage sheds that we had that needed to be uh, looked at, cleaned out, repaired, fixed up and reorganized to get rid of old junk that didn't work and uh, clean it up. And here you see uh, on the left Steve and uh, up above Mike uh, assisting with that project. They also put little storage boxes into one of the sheds and were able to throughout the building find all of those screws and nuts and bolts that everyone had donated that were just in boxes everywhere and organized them. One of the projects we did was to install sheetrock, uh, a safety issue at the parsonage between the single car garage and the house structure itself which required uh, sheetrock. The guys got together one morning, uh, there were seven and uh, by 12 noon they had installed, screwed, mudded and taped uh, the sheetrock so that that portion of the building was much safer and uh, more airtight. And here you can see uh, Bob on the left and Mike and John Benner, uh, Hal in the middle, um, Jack was there and so was Steve uh, doing a lot of work and here you see some of the mudding and taping uh, there in that middle frame. We had a VIM team, a wonderful VIM team come in from Oklahoma. Uh, there you see uh, Shrug, the uh, crew leader. They were going to remove the broken and damaged and concrete that people were tripping on in the entryway only to discover that uh, the old concrete for the first building had been left in place and a second layer of concrete placed on top of it more than a foot deep, probably close to 18 inches deep and they had to remove the old concrete with jackhammers. The team of mainly high school seniors from Oklahoma came in, they backfilled with gravel as the picture on the right shows and then they had a concrete company come in and do that concrete work. And here you see the uh, team leader along with one of the high school seniors preparing that uh, finished grade and it sure is nice to have it. The parsonage uh, has a deck that needed uh, uh, structural uh, improvements and those same people from Oklahoma, the Lost Creek uh, Methodist Church there in Stillwater, Oklahoma provided the workmen and uh, you see all of the sonotopes in place so that uh, the church trustees can complete this project before the fall hits us. Thank you very much for looking at this. Uh, we still need some additional funds and if you could provide us with some of those funds that would be wonderful. Soldatna United Methodist Church 158 South Binkley Street in Soldatna, Alaska 99669